early in the morning, so I have to be quiet. But this is, for the next two days, it's gonna be an event day. We're going to Mark Lack's event. Uh, it's all about like personal branding, online marketing, everything like that. So we're gonna be filming a lot and then we're also gonna be learning a bunch about our online businesses. Super thankful for Jeff and it wouldn't have happened without him. So super thankful and um, I just wanted to show you guys, I kind of messed up. So I brought all shorts and only two pairs of pants for five days. And it's been kind of chilly here. It's really rainy today, super rainy. It's gonna be rainy tomorrow. I think it's gonna be raining like all the rest of the time. So I have to make those two pairs of pants work. <laughs> and I'm kind of freezing right now. So this is like the heaviest sweater I have. But you know what? It's better than Canada. I came from the snow. It was pretty snowy when I left. So um, not complaining. Super excited for the day. And then we're gonna meet up with Marco and yeah so it's just gonna be the three of us um at the event and then we're gonna go maybe check out the beach check out the water or do something afterwards let's see what today brings <music> Woo! we're going going back back to cali cali <laughs> to Mark Lack's course. Woo! It's gonna be good. Driving LA is interesting. Right now it's not rush hour, thank God. Because uh, normally we would be hitting rush hour at 7.45. We'll see where the evening takes us. Alright, so we are at the Marriott. This is where the course is going to be held for the two days. So nice. It is super nice and sunny out now. So I guess the universe was giving us a blessing, um, knowing that we're only here for a couple more days and we're on lunch right now. Um, learned a, a huge amount of value already. Um, so glad to be here. I learned that investing in yourself and in your education and you know investing your time into knowledge and growing and learning more is always so important. I want to always be learning more. That was an amazing, amazing first day. I'm so ready to imply what I learned. Um, so another big takeaway I learned was to let go of expectations. And I tend to expect quite a bit um, in my own reality. If you think about it, everyone has their own reality, everyone has their own opinion, and you can't expect anything from anyone um, because you're not in control of that. You can only really, you can't even really expect anything from yourself. You can only just know that, you know, whatever's meant to happen is going to happen. And, you know, you can't really guarantee tomorrow, so why expect something that hasn't already happened yet? Because you never know, you know, where life is gonna turn. And yeah, so I just think that we should all just do what fulfills us the most, do what we're passionate about, and everything will fall into place. All right, yo, we are in Balboa. What is it, Balboa? Fun zone. Park? No, Balboa, Balboa something. Balboa Beach? That's the one. Anyways, we're here at the pier, about to go check out the fun zone. 
Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Day two Day Mark two. Lack's personal branding course. We're headed to the beach to get some quick one minute videos, just whatever the heck we want before the course. Content. And we're gonna pick up Margo to go to the beach first. So see you there. Gabby's over there running over. <laughs> I've never ever seen the ocean before. <laughs> this is seriously one of the most amazing views of my life. I'm serious. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. So it's day two of the event and there is so much that I've learned through the past couple of days and I'm literally so thankful. You know, the universe is always bringing us exactly what we need. This was literally exactly what I needed and at the start I didn't even really realize it. Now I'm starting to realize why and sometimes we don't really know why something's happening right away. Um, you know, maybe in a year from now, or you know, 10 months, or even a day or two afterwards, you'll be sitting there and you'll be like, well, that's why that happened. And so that's sort of what's happening to me right now is the fact that, you know, I came here not really knowing why I did, but now I'm, ex I'm realizing exactly why this is happening for me. I just wanted to say that I think events are really, really important for you, your soul, your mind, your business. Because without events, I don't know where I would be. The last event, like in August that I went to, was a, a life-changing event. And when I left, looking back to the last event, I have come so far, so far. And I've gotten so uncomfortable and I've learned so many things. I've opened my life up to new possibilities. And this event, I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. I'm actually like shaking right now because of how moved I, am, I really am. I know that they're so powerful. They are so powerful to get yourself around those people. I feel a shift. I feel a transformation on a vibrational level, on a molecular level. And I just know that, you know, I'm gonna continue to keep coming to events like this because it will change you. It will bring you closer to your dreams. Last day here, pretty disappointed. It's like pouring rain. Yeah, we were supposed to go to the pier and I don't think that's gonna happen anymore. It was the one thing I'm really, really excited to do. Everything happens for a reason. I've been learning a lot about that this whole weekend. So maybe it'll happen, maybe it won't. So we will see. Yeah, I'm just hoping for the best.
super rainy here. Like literally has been pouring all day, but we ended up going to a couple different places. The Museum of Selfies, that was really, really fun. And now we're going to the Cat Cafe. Um, we might actually even end up going to the Santa Monica Pier anyways, even though we can't take any rides. That happens a lot. And we're gonna go to a really high class dinner place. So even though the day didn't work out quite as planned, um, it still worked out and I'm still really, really grateful that I'm here. They're so cute. It's our last dinner here, so gonna make the most out of it. Can't wait to see the restaurant. It's super cool. It's like dress coated so that's interesting never been to that before so we got to the pier we didn't get to go on any rides they're all closed now we like just missed them but they're so cool finally stopped raining and yeah, I'm in awe. Got to see the ocean again. Yeah, that's good. It's good. It's good. I love the ocean so much. 